that's the easy part. <laughs> Sometimes recognizing the obstacle in the first place is the trick. So I'd like to read um, two poems again from this rapid series that, that concern this um, meeting of the obstacle. The first one is a kind of young version and the second one is a kind of not quite as young but still young version. Um, this is View with Teenage Girl. View with teenage girl. The blue knit top, the scooped out neck, and column of gleaming buttons a boy could look at very, very closely, <laughs> and say in a hoarse, jokey voice, How about I take a look at those buttons? And after an age that no sound fills but a soft drumming in her ears, she would say, So. You look with your hands, do you? That's the summer she learns about two kinds of boy. One who replies, aha, uh -huh, sure do, and moves easily on, having basically been walked. And another who, missing the beat, feels sharply ashamed, as though he's been caught stealing, so instantly hates her, hates all girls, even his mother, who appears for a ghastly second to actually be a girl. But that passes, and he gathers himself and manages a second try. And she loves him a little for being not simple, for his slight, incomprehensible pause, that small eddy in his excitement she finds so tender as it pulls her into the current she has no real clue underlies it. <laughs> <laughs>